Hi there, I am Devin, I'm with OLO Lighting, and I will walk you through how to get your in-range OLO control box connected to your home network. Now this could be for the first time starting up, or this could be you just got a new router, changed your password, or a variety of reasons why you need to get our system connected to your internet. So I'm gonna head up to the box and show you some things on the control board that'll tell you what it's doing, and then we'll go through the steps to get it connected to your home internet. So we'll head up here and I'm gonna open the box. And in this situation, in this one, it, it is currently connected to a network. So these two lights here, those are always gonna indicate power. This light right here, that's gonna ind indicate network connection. So if you're ever trying to control your lights through your home network and that light isn't on, you're not gonna be able to control it because it's not connected to anything. So. Um, this tells me we have power, we are connected, but we're going to go ahead and go through the steps of getting it connected to a new network. Now, this box is connected to the home network, but it's also broadcasting its own localized network. And that password changes when you connect it to your home network. Now, typically we recommend that it matches your home Wi-Fi password, so that's the same amount of security. Um, but you're free to change it to any password you want. Um, let's say you forget that password. Uh, it happens to all of us um, when, you, when you're connecting this and, and now you don't know the password to this localized network. We're going to go ahead and hold this button here for four flashes. And there are written instructions right here. Those four flashes that you have to hold for about 25 seconds to get to come on, um, that'll reset the box as if it just came from the factory. It's going to wipe everything clean. Um, it's going to disconnect from the home network and now it's going to start broadcasting just at that default password of one through eight. All right, now let's go ahead and hold that button. There's one flash. Two flashes. Three flashes, about 10 more seconds. And after four flashes, you'll let go. And soon these lights are gonna start ping-ponging back to each other. They're gonna start flashing and dancing. We're gonna let the box just do its thing. And in about five to 10 minutes, we're gonna come back and it'll be as good as new and, and ready to do everything again. We are gonna connect our OELO system to a Wi-Fi network. So right now it's broadcasting its own network. And now you're gonna to need to stand fairly close to the box. I'm talking 15, 20 feet. Um, and then you're gonna to go to your phone settings. So I'm gonna pull out my phone here. We're gonna to go to our phone settings and we are gonna to go to uh, available Wi-Fi networks. So we're gonna go there and it's gonna load all the networks you can see. Now if you're standing right near the box and an OELO network isn't coming up, we're gonna go ahead and turn off Wi-Fi, turn it back on. Um, until that network comes up, there's not much more we can do. Um, so that network's right there, so I'm gonna go ahead and click on it. The default password is always gonna be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I go ahead and hit that, and it's gonna join here. And so most phones here at this step, you know, it's still trying to connect. It may say, hey, this network doesn't have internet. Do you wanna stay connected or keep trying? Something along those lines. Um, you're gonna to wanna to say, yes, I do wanna stay connected, keep trying, because this network is just to communicate to our control box to get it connected to your home's internet. So now that I'm connected there, I'm gonna go ahead and leave and I'm gonna to go to our app. We're gonna open that, it opens right up. If it opens to this screen here, that means it's working. That means we have a connection. I can go and control my lights and turn them on. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and go to settings and we'll see there outside Wi-Fi, not connected. We wanna get that connected. So we're gonna go ahead and click on that not connected and now it's gonna pull up the networks it can see. Now you may need to pull down and refresh the page and now we see the network we're gonna to wanna to connect it to. I'm gonna to wanna to get it connected to this. And so this is where you're gonna type in your password. Now, once you type in the password to this network, um, it is going to ask you to change the password for the OELO box network as well. Now, I always recommend changing this password to the same password as your Wi-Fi network so that you don't forget it. Um, but so I'm gonna go ahead and type this in and I'm also gonna change the other password. And then I would recommend writing down that OELO Wi-Fi network password just in case you get a new Wi-Fi router or you decide you change your password for your whole network. It's easy to connect to this box and get it reconnected. So 
So now it's gonna try and connect. And so as it tries to connect here, um, if it fails for any reason, it'll just kick you back out and you'll have to reconnect on that OLO network and start this process again. Um, when it's successful, that's when it's gonna go, hey, now you need to change the password to your OLO box. And so there we go, it was successful. Um, now we see here outside Wi-Fi there, and now I have all my programs here. I can change the colors and everything works. Now I can receive updates um, if we do any patches for new programs to you know, make the lights dance better. It'll all update automatically.